Hey guys, New York Fosters here, and today we are back with another episode of Foster Fridays. And I am so sorry that I haven't been able to get videos out and everything. I've actually been in Las Vegas. Yeah, I know it sounds kind of crazy, but my mom actually called me up last weekend and was like, hey, you should come home. And I was like, what are you talking about? And apparently she and my whole family surprised me and took me to Vegas and took one of my best friends with me. And yeah, it was it was really crazy. So it was a lot of fun, but I'd never been to Vegas before, so it was really interesting. But anyway, at the start of this episode, I wanted to start off by getting a wolf, like a little dog as a pet, because I've been exploring around here. This is where I get most of my wood around here. And there's like this tiny little forest, and it, I don't know, it's... I've seen some dogs around here and some wolves, and I really, really want a pet, so let's go find one. And of course, you guys get to name him. Uh, I don't know what I'll find, but we'll go searching around here. Hey, pig. Okay, so we... Oh, here it is. Here you are. Hey, come over here. I found one. I can't believe I found a wolf. No, don't go over there. <laughs> All right, come here. Let's see how many bones. One bone. Wow, you're you're pretty eager to be my pet, aren't you? Come on. All right, so if you have a name for this guy, leave it in the comments, please. I want to know. <laughs> okay, so we're back here at the house, and... Oh, you scared me there. I didn't know what you were doing. All right, so today's request comes from mroth23. Thank you for this request. I am going to be building a harbor for this ship and um you guys have such awesome ideas it's really hard to pick some of these things but i wanted to do more of a like an easier one this week just because i had so much going on and this one wouldn't take up a horrible amount of time so that's what i wanted to do but yeah uh but thank you for all your submissions of all the things you want me to build i mean it's awesome i can't wait to build some of the things you have there so if you wrote, like, um, something you wanted me to build a long time ago, like, on the first episode or the second episode or anything, I'll probably go back and look at those uh, a couple of times and see what you guys wanted me to build and probably build it again. Because you guys have really cool ideas. It's just, I, I might have to make them into two parts or something. I don't know. So, but thanks again. And if you have any more suggestions, please leave them below because I love the challenge of building this stuff it's it's really fun so besides just building building a little harbor i wanted to kind of build a store so i think we're gonna kind of cut into this mountain over here and maybe make like i don't know like a bait shop or something whatever it would be around a giant ship probably not a bait shop but i think i'm just gonna go with that anyway just just for fun so Right now we're just building the little deck that kind of comes off when you're in a harbor. I don't know how to de just describe it there, but uh, yeah, something like that. So we'll put like little supports and stuff right here. And yeah, so if you, if I promise you a shout out, uh, I know there's several of you, don't worry. They're coming up in the next How to Beat the End series episode, which will be up by next Thursday, Tuesday, sorry. I'm so sorry I haven't been able to do everything. I really was not expecting to go to Vegas, but it was really fun. We stayed there for, I got back Friday afternoon, I think. Yeah, so it was it was just so much fun. And yeah, so I, I had a blast. And it's fun to go there. If you go there, go there when you're 21 because you can't really do anything unless you are 21 because you know there's a lot of gambling and drinking and all kinds of things so yeah I would definitely suggest going there I don't think I'll probably go there again but yeah I really had a fun time there all right uh hey we're back again and I cut it off there because it was getting dark outside and I wanted to go sleep and I didn't want you guys to watch me slowly make the trek back up to my house <laughs> Hey guys, I'm back here in the editing room, <laughs> which is iMovie. Oh, it's so fancy, right? But um, I just had to speed this up again for time constraints because it really does take a huge amount of time for my computer to kind of go through all this stuff. So I just wanted to speed it up. I try to keep these under like 25 minutes and yeah, so sorry for speeding it up, but... and. 
You know, I can hear, when I'm doing this, I can hear the dog I have over there, like, squeaking, and it sounds really funny, you know, because he's barking, so <laughs> maybe that should be his name, Squeaky or something. Oh, no, that'd be terrible. But, yeah, again, if you have a name for him, leave it below because I think you guys can come up with some really awesome names. So, yeah, let's get this speed show going. <laughs> so I'm basically just building the steps and stuff here just because it needs it. And then I think, yeah, I'm going to be clearing this area out right here and making it a bait shop. So that will take a while. I think I'll cut away from here and yeah. All right guys, so I kind of built some stuff up here. I put a little trail right over here and I carved out a little bit into the side of this mountain so that we could put the bait shop back here just because it was really taking a long time. And again, there's a bunch of time restrictions when I get a better computer and all that kind of stuff, these will be a lot longer. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, I think this whole episode is going to take a while, so I'm not sure how long it's going to take. But anyway, right now I'm just going to be building kind of the outside of here, and I chose regular wood just because, I don't know, I really like regular wood, and I could have done jungle wood because we are by the jungle, but I kind of liked how it was just normal and we used the pine wood for the ship so it's a little darker and it makes it a little more mysterious <laughs> but um yeah I kind of wanted to make this look like a tent but not really so I'm gonna put some fencing up here just because that'll look a little cool and then we'll just put like a regular wood and roof on top like with wood planks and kind of make it extend out like kind of like a triangle so that it looks I don't know you'll have to see I'm kind of trying to picture it in my head but it's kind of hard to describe so I'll just do it and then you guys can see what it looks like so we're gonna have to hop up here and kind of check things out and yeah okay so we'll get this roof put up right here I think we'll we'll extend it right here yeah, this looks, this looks pretty cool. So this can be kind of like the start of a little town in here. Uh, I do want to build along the mountain because I think it looks kind of cool. And I just really like the feel of everything. Oh, and I'm putting the seed in the description be in case you want to play here or something. And I might end up like downloading the world and you guys can download it for yourself. I just have to kind of figure out how to use Mediafire because I haven't really ever toyed with that or anything so yeah um if you guys want me to figure out how to download this stuff and so you guys can play in this world let me know and or if you want to wait till it gets more built up or anything just uh, I can do it every week I can fix this and every th time I build a new thing I can re-download it or whatever because I know that you can do that I just haven't really uh gone out of my way to figure out how to do it so yeah if you guys want this save file, let me know. But I will be putting the seed in the description so that you guys can come find this. Because there's there's a bunch of really cool things in here. Like the, the NPC village is awesome. And this is a little bit of a trek away from the spawn point. But it's not too far. You guys can find it pretty easily. So, alright. Right now I am just getting this all cleared out and putting some wooden planks on here just to kind of make it more of like a dock type area. So this will be a lot easier for me to get in and out of the boat. And I will be doing other things with the boat later. I just am kind of lazy with it for now. <laughs> All right. Hey, guys, I'm back here again, and I am speeding this up as per usual. <laughs> and it's just another boring, like, putting the ceiling on and the walls in for the wooden plank area so I kind of want to make make this have like a boatsy feel I, I couldn't I wanted to put like you know those lifesaver things I'm not life preservers that's what they're called and like the little round things that have like um 
red and white stripes on them. I thought that would look kind of cool, but you know, they don't have that kind of stuff in Minecraft. So I just used like ladders and stuff like that. So you guys, you guys will see that in a little bit. But um, right now I'm just putting the wooden walls in and making it look nice and pretty. <laughs> so here we go, kind of getting it all done. <laughs> all right, so I like this kind of like wooden pillar thing and that's like kind of if you want to buy something you come right up here and yeah no that doesn't look great all right we'll just maybe we'll put some fences over here i think that would look kind of cool let's see how that goes um oh yeah it looks cool yeah i don't like that middle thing never mind let's take it out <laughs> okay uh yeah so that would be like hey give me some fish or <laughs> whatever you're trying to you know fish with or whatever maybe I should put some fishing rods in there uh but I'll do that later since I don't and I'll put some fish in here later too so all right let's clear this out because you need a, a way to enter here for the employees so let's um I, I think the door would be good right here so we'll just we'll just make this look a little nicer here with some dirt I don't like seeing stone when there's a bunch of dirt around and it looks kind of bad and I mean if you're ma trying to make it look natural then that it's good to just leave the like everything there but if you're trying to make it look more uniform and organized then you can just kind of mess with it yourself so let's put these stairs over here so that the employees can get in and out and that's not where I should have put those stairs oops oh well that's okay so yeah so tell me what your guys's favorite vacation has been if you've been on one recently or just you know your whole life I mean Vegas was definitely not one of my favorites I mean I liked it I had a blast but um it was really crowded there I think like San Diego would be one of mine I haven't actually been out of the country I've been everywhere in the country that you can think of except like uh, the northeast I haven't been around there and um, I've been in the south a lot <laughs> I actually used to live in New Orleans so um, I went to school there for a year so that was fun I I've kind of transferred around a lot in college so yeah I went there I went to um, school college in New Orleans so that was really fun and yeah I've been all around <laughs> And I've been to Florida a few times, too. All right, so we are back here again. And I think I was talking to you about um, schools. I don't I cut the video off again. Sorry, I just kind of realized once the sunset was coming. But anyway, um, yeah, leave in the comments below where your favorite vacation was or something. Um, but yeah, let's get everything kind of organized I want to put a workbench in here obviously and I know I have one already built but um that's the one I carry around with me like when I'm going exploring or something I think it's always good to have a workbench with you just you know because you always need one um so yeah that looks kind of cool um trying to think what else I want to put in here let's put some stairs I mean not stairs but um like chairs so that people can sit in here that looks kind of cool. Um, trying to think. I'll put some of the little side things on it, you know, like for signs, um, how they do. That I think it looks kind of cool. I like how Minecraft's getting more like tailored for people who do decorating stuff, like me, and who do building and stuff like that, because it's it's kind of cool uh, to you know build and decorate houses and stuff like that. So we'll put these little signs over here. And make them like little armrests for the chairs. So that looks kind of cool. And we'll make some furnaces. Because you never know when you need a furnace. Uh, it's always pretty necessary in Minecraft. So we'll get those going. And we'll put them right above this little area. I don't know what I was doing with this. But I thought it looked kind of cool. So we'll just keep it like that. And yeah. Alright. Um, trying to think what else all right okay guys so I kind of moved this ladder around I, I wasn't really liking it um yeah I didn't know where to put it exactly but we'll just we'll just keep it right there I think 
we will build a chest because, you know, all these shops need chests, of course, so we'll do that really fast. Um, and we can keep just, like, the bait in there because this is a bait shop. And I'll get, I have a bunch of fish uh, at my little home base, so I'll, I'll put those in there later. And uh, maybe some fishing rods later, too, if I remember. So, and... Yeah, all right, let's make the sign for this because it is Mroth 23's idea. So let's get that going out over here. All right, so let's say uh, welcome to Mroth 23's bait shop. Oh, we'll just call it a bait shop. <laughs> um, and yeah, so if you want that changed, Mroth, just leave a comment. I can name it something else because... Uh, I do actually want to and uh, need to change the name of um, the ship thing, but I will do that later uh, because Coopstar wants it named something else, so I'll do that. But yeah, I thought a waterfall would look kind of cool right here, so um, I kind of built some stuff out of here, and I don't know, I really like waterfalls, it's just kind of my thing with that, so um, the employees can still come up here and we need to make a door for them really fast all right let's let's get the doors so that'll look nice like you come home from you know pillaging villages <laughs> from being a pirate and then you have this nice little area where you can buy fish <laughs> and weird stuff like that all right all right let's block that off a little bit oh that looks nice nice little waterfall and a nice little area to run into there so Let's light this up a little bit over here just because we don't want any monsters spawning, of course. Oh, look how nice that looks. All right, um, let's go up here and light because I know I didn't put any lights up here. All right, that should be good. And, oh, I need to put some lighting underneath the dock because I know I haven't put any under here. Oh, well, that's good. I have some from the, the ship over here, but it's still kind of dark down here. All right, let's put a couple there. All right. And it is getting dark outside, um, but I have a few things more to show you. Oh, I actually did build, build a wheat farm into the mountain across the way. Oh, and I put some glowstone like lighting up there if you saw it for a second. But anyway, I wanted to show you this wheat farm really fast because you can see it from my house. And I built it a while ago um, because I was really running out of food and I needed it really badly. I needed some wheat. So let's go in here. It's kind of like a glass open wheat farm. Come on up here, boy. All right. Um, and we'll just we'll just hop on in here. And yeah, I mean, it's just like a basic wheat farm. Obviously, I haven't collected wheat in a while, but I probably need some food here coming up. And yeah, so it's been here for a while. And I have like over there, it says like, seeds and like extra wheat and stuff like that I mean uh, basic stuff like that and oh I forgot to put the raw fish away I did grab some I have about like a couple I have like 20 or so raw fish so I just I grabbed like four of them and we need to go put it back in the bait shop and there's the glowstone lights I thought it looked kind of cool so I put them on the dock and everything all right, so yeah, we'll put these in here and that will be the end of the episode. All right, thank you guys so much for watching and yeah, I'll talk to you later, guys.